All right, good morning, good morning. Hope you're having a wonderful day. So we have a load today, picking up from Burlington, Iowa, going to Arkansas. So let's get going, let's get there. We've done our free trip, everything went well. And we are ready to roll. Uh-oh, what was that? All right, cool. We are ready to go. Um, it's a rainy, rainy morning. It is Thursday. Um, I'll be doing um, OTR for this week just to see how much revenue you can generate in a 20 foot box truck. And so far we're doing pretty okay. We did not have a load yesterday, so we did decide to come home and rest. Um, well, we did have one yesterday dropped off at Des Moines, Iowa. And then we decided to come home and rest. And now we are heading back out to, uh, what'd you call it? What would you call it? To, um, to pick up another one tonight, today. In the meantime, I'll also be looking for one for tomorrow. Or that one that I can pick up today. This one is um, going about 300 and some change miles, I believe. I need to double check that. Right now we got a deadhead uh, 67 miles to go pick it up, which is fine. And then And then once we get loaded, we, we're picking up at a hospital, so once we get loaded, we'll go, be able to go ahead and uh, and proceed to the delivery location. It's about a six-hour drive. Shouldn't be that bad. We'll do my best to get there today. And the receiving end is also a hospital, so the good news is hospitals are open 24-7. Hopefully... They'll be able to receive me today so I can be empty for tomorrow and I can be able to figure out where I'm going tomorrow. But till then let's get let's hit some uh, some miles on the road and uh, let's go. See you at uh, pickup. this because this doesn't look right but we have this giant box here it's quite heavy and then i've just decided to put this gut right here to protect it and my pallet jack i shouldn't move i don't think yeah, i shouldn't move we are at the fuel station trying to uh get some fuel still got I believe uh, six hours to go um, my drive clock says I have eight hours to go so I have two hours to spare and uh, yeah we're still looking for loads uh, let's push it back over there still looking for loads um, trying to get one for I'm getting out of uh, uh, what you call that place drive forward I'm supposed to be serving our brake so I don't want to like turn on my brake count 
So we gotta go quite slowly so we don't trigger our brake situation here. So we made it to our drop-off facility, um, arrived here last night at around about 10, uh, 10.30, 10, 10.30. Um, so this is the place, it's, it's the hospital, the receiving end is on this side, as you can see, oh, there's a guy moving there, he's just waving. The receiving end is on this side, you could see, it's, I'm on, yeah, so I'm on the receiving side receiving and uh, uh, shipping side so I'm gonna be on one of those docks uh, my clock does reset in about an hour and 30 minutes give or take so ideally what we're gonna do is we're gonna chill here for a little bit and then wait in the meantime I'll be looking at loads on the computer just trying to uh, find something to get out of here and hopefully we'll do that we'll get one um it was a very pretty chilled drive all the way until we got to the mountainside i don't know if anybody from here here i mean youtube here is from um northern arkansas but you guys have some nice hilly areas like if you haven't been to arkansas northern arkansas you should definitely check it out um, it's quite quite a scenery, I would say that. Um, very, very hilly, uh, smooth drive. I think it's one of those places that you always see on uh, motorcycle commercials. Um, and you see uh, um, them going on the back roads because that's what it felt like. It was uh, twists and turns. Um, the speed limit was 55, but I was actually going 35 because it was, there was, there was a lot of turns. It was, it was really, really... Um, challenging but uh, fun uh, to drive along that road. Anyways, I wasn't able to film much on the uh, night time uh, because of those turns again. Um, I wanted to just make sure I'm focusing on the, low, uh, on the road. Um, I did check the, the um, what do you call it? I did check the shipment, uh, the uh, package that we are carrying and it is well secure the back so nothing moved which was great um it's a very very long box hopefully i'll be able to show you guys and uh yeah well, it was pretty cool it's a nice motorcycle i'm wondering if this guy's coming up this way no he's not anyways um yeah it was very very uh well secure so i'm happy about that they didn't move uh, none of them moved i have two pallet jacks one that i'm leaving here it's a very long pallet jack and the other one i um it's mine so i'll be taking Oh, of course, I'll be uh, carrying it with me. Uh, but uh, definitely, I'll show you guys the offloading so at least you have an idea of what we are talking about if you did not see the onboarding. Anyways, um, let's chill, let's wait. Uh, I'll be shopping for loads. And uh, once we get one, we'll, I'll let you guys know. All right, see you in a few. All right, so 
forgot to uh, show you guys the uh, offloading of the previous product but if you did watch the loading then you already know so right now we are on the second uh, pickup for the day well no uh, the second fast pickup for this day second for you guys and guess what we're picking up yep this is what we're picking up today now it does drop um, today I'm gonna drop it today um, the facility I'm going to is 24 7 so, so that's when it's gonna drop uh, I'm not sure what they want from me so they told me that I should just stay here where I am and they'll bring it I'm guessing they will be putting me up with something. I don't know what. To find out. Ooh, it is hot, hot tomatoes. I'm just gonna chill in the car while I wait. I don't know what they're gonna bring me, but we'll see. Oh man. Who said you can't uh who said you can't do it with a 20 foot box drop? Whoever said it should be ashamed of themselves. Because we are here doing it. Alright, let's see what we're gonna be loaded with. Alright, so we got loaded with this. Little nugget right here. So he just came in and dropped it in. So I decided to use my bars right here to protect it. And a little piece of wood so it doesn't roll this way. It doesn't go this way. So hopefully that won't move. We'll probably roll and check it and make sure that doesn't move or anything like that. I think it should be good. I don't think that's gonna move, so we'll see. All right. <laughs> All right. Let's go get up the park. All right, good people. We just got loaded, so we're gonna go ahead and head out. Um, it says I'm gonna be there at 7.29 p.m. I will do my best to get there at 7.29 p.m. I'm estimating that I'm probably gonna take a 30 minute break, so it's probably gonna be there at eight, which that will be perfect because that will allow me to